So I'm going to go through and show you a few of the features that I've been using on this tablet. I have the live wallpaper for Skyrim in the background. Uh, it looks pretty cool. Um, I can go through and show you a video that I recorded with this as well. Um, so I'm using the digital zoom right there. It records in an uh, in MP4. So. so there's that. Um, actually, have Chrome on here. So. I've been playing Entanglement um, like I do on my laptop. It's just a, a different type of interface with the touchscreen interface, and uh, it works pretty good. So it's another thing, but the sound doesn't work. So that's cool. You can see. You can touch it. I'm going to use the pen to interact with it here. So forth and so on. Yeah, you can see that that works. If you want to swap, you can tap and hold it. And then it swaps out. So. That's it for that. I can bring up the last things that I had open. Let me close out of those. Mm, you know, I use Dropbox and Pandora, all that good stuff. Um, so I don't have the keyboard attached right now, but that's fine. Um, yeah, I mean, you know, you can go through and read a book. Uh, I have um, Google's book app is called Playbook now. So you can read The Art of War. I actually have the original pages here and you can turn them like normal. Or you can go to uh, You can change, you know, whether or not you want to see it in a day or night version. So if you see it in night version, then you'll be seeing white text with black letters. Um, and you can also. I don't have the brightness up too much. Oh, there it is. That's brighter. change the text type to flowing text and so it's not like a scanned version of the book anymore and it still works pretty well to turn it it's that yeah. you can still browse YouTube pretty well and so on check mail, uh, can edit notes, 
so I have all those notes. Mm -hmm. Can you use your pictures? 